Today, we are diving deeper into the cutting edge of Z-Image Turbo with the newly released Fun Control Knit Union series. The models arrived just two weeks ago, and while the comfy UI implementation is lightning fast, we are already seeing some experimental features that require manual tuning to get pro results. First things first, make sure you have updated Comfy UI to at least version 0.7. We need those latest Z-Image Turbo native nodes to even see these new models in action. When you head into your workflow templates, you will find the official Z-Image Turbo control knit workflow. It is currently compressed into a subgraph, which is great for keeping things tidy, but not very helpful for understanding how the gears are actually turning. Go ahead and right-click to unpack that subgraph so we can see the full node architecture. I have cleaned this up by removing unnecessary nodes and fixing the seed to zero to keep our testing consistent. Starting with control knit 1.0, the key node here is the QN image diff synth control knit. If we use standard open pose guides, it works perfectly. Our prompt is simple, a Latina model kneeling on the floor in heavy rain. But things get interesting when we try to inpaint. For this test, I am using the mask editor to select this black dress and prompting for a change to blue. I will connect the mask output from the load image directly to the mask input of our QN node. After running the workflow, the mask is clearly helping, but this isn't traditional inpainting. It feels more like a totally new image in a new environment. This makes sense, as the developers have confirmed on their Hugging Face README that version 1.0 does not officially support inpainting. This is where the Z-Image Fun Control Knit node comes in. This node is so new it isn't even documented in the official templates yet. It adds those critical inputs for inpaint image and mask which are essential for targeted edits. After organizing our canvas into separate groups for 1.0 and 2.0, we confirmed that this new node does not work with control knit 1.0. It simply throws an error. Moving up to control knit 2.0, the results are night and day. Once we engage 2.0, the generation ignores the global prompt for the most part, no more Latina model or heavy rain, and focuses almost exclusively on the blue dress. This is traditional inpainting. At this point, we can actually disconnect the primary image input entirely. This puts the node into a pure inpainting mode, generating the change based only on the mask and prompt without needing external open pose guides. Now for the absolute latest, Control Knit 2.1. This version is faster because it fixes a typo in the 2.0 code that was accidentally running the layer blocks twice. However, be aware of its internal bias. In my testing, 2.1 tends to favor more revealing or stylized character interpretations compared to the more conservative 2.0. Neither result is perfect here. You can see some artifacts due to the rough mask I painted, but the logic is working. Finally, we have the experimental 2.18 step model. This is distilled for maximum speed, but as you can see, it currently produces significant noise and artifacts. It is likely that the comfy UI implementation is still catching up to Alibaba's distillation method, or the model simply needs more training. For now, I recommend sticking with the standard 2.0 or 2.1 for the best balance of quality and reliability. Looking at all eight generated images side by side, we can safely say the eight step model isn't there yet, regardless of whether you use open pose. For the 2.0 and 2.1 versions, I personally prefer the results with open pose guidance, as the ones without it allow for a bit too much freedom in the pose. As for the original Control Knit 1.0, it remains perfectly viable as long as you don't need in painting capabilities. For the absolute best results, we still recommend our advanced two-step K sampler workflow from the previous video. It produces much more detailed and convincing results than these single-pass methods. 
and that's the node. All open source, no filler. Thank you for watching. Grab the file, keep creating.